hat. Okay, I see, I see. That's I see. the hat. All right. I actually really like this Inkling skin. It looks sick. All right, tweet is out. Go retweet it, my my wonderful viewers. I tweet out every match uh, just as it starts or as fast as I can. Anyway, so let's get into this. Yeah, so already seeing some pretty even percents. We're on PS2, so we got a lot of room uh, to, to deal with. And these are both characters who like their space. You know, Inkling's going to try and hit and run, and like the moment uh, danger comes in, going to try and get out of dodge and, you know, five miles to the other side of the stage. But in when you're in that retreat, Villager starts building a house, making some local governments. It could it can be scary, you know? Ooh. Oh. Also, I just okay, that's not it. I do want to point out that some of most of this stutter that's happening is coming from Mike's side. Already dropping uh, about 60 packets. While Skunkle has dropped 13. You know, not it's not that in the season and the fact that it's in the first minute, so I'm, I'm kind of worried about the, the, the internet connections, but we'll see. All right, we're getting, into, we're getting into position to try and end these first stocks on both sides. And the... Nice rising up air. Yeah, the latent hit of the up air as well. Like, not even the first one. And yeah. All right, Skunkle very away. Oh my God, Mike just up uh, forward smash, forward smash, forward smash. <laughs> uh, Works every time. All right. Ooh, 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 no way. Okay. Oh yeah. I thought Mike was gonna nair Skunkle under the PS2 stage and pineapple. That's what I thought was gonna happen. I was scared. Skunkle is too cute to make mistakes like that. Apparently. No, right. I really like that falling up or follow up through Skunkle. Ooh. Oh, but, sick. But Mike doing some some sick ish right here. Alright. I like the fact that Skunkle kind of like maximizes their time in the air off stage. Wow! Using the. There's. The, 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 the ink gun doesn't push inkling back in the air does it like he just he just used it to like cancel his movement right to just dodge the the bowling ball and my god the Skunkle's catching up with the with the drops by the way uh 70 80 oh my god i'm pretty sure it was his own yeah. net drop that uh that killed him and then oh my we, <laughs> uh, this is amazing the contest of the internet it's like we got the what is it the the spectrum versus um what what's the what's the king evil internet provider oh i wouldn't even know it's rain and packets they're just falling from the sky they're, we're both into triple digits of packet drops comcast there we go thank you mouse rat yeah we got spectrum versus comcast in here uh, maybe special guest Xfinity. This is this is all very true. Oh! oh! But you know when when the packets are dropping and you gotta wait for the next frame, you you can find solace in just gardening. You know, it's very peaceful. Uh, time just you know washes away, and uh, sometimes uh, your your plants will take out your opponents for you, and boom. Crazy how nature does that. Uh, Mouse Rat, we, uh, I'm glad that you asked that question. Mouse Rat asked, can my match be on stream to make the lag test easier? We here at Xeno have four, or no, I think three separate setups outside of stream that are all Sable Detect ready. So if you have uh, worries uh, versus an opponent, you can hit up everyone's favorite TO, Dill, and uh, they'll send you the, the credentials to join an arena, 
and Sable Detect will be right there watching your match. Because if there's one thing that Xeno Wi-Fi cares about, it is minimizing the Wi-Fi as much as possible. So, trying to look out for all the good connections. Yeah, and yeah, in the Discord. Just, uh, just hit her up there, uh, and yeah. We, we have like a little Sable farm. It, it was pretty fun to set up. Ba -na 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 -na. All right, I guess we're just going into it. I, I would imagine one of them were to, would want to call, uh, call a test or something, like proof of land by anybody. And yeah, thank you, Joe Pone and Mouse Rat. Much love to you too. But yeah, uh, I guess they're just like, well, I see we both are on Wi-Fi, so we will both suffer together. We're both anyway. entering the depths of hell. Yeah. Right. So anyway, running it back to PS2. Uh, let's see what happens in this run back. Any sort of adjustment Skunkle can make. Whoa, all right. Mike using the... Uh, the option to ride the gyro, because if you hit shield with it, you just kind of jump off of it and you don't get put into special fall. Kind of a, you know, slightly underused uh, tactic, I feel. But I understand the commitment that it can give you. All right, pretty good edge guard going up by Skunkle. Ooh, and actually gets the kill. Very nice. I love when players go really far off stage for those edge guards, and especially Glink. Because you have that long up B recovery, so why not go that far? Yeah, yeah. really take advantage of the uh, the maximum airtime your uh, your character is able to uh, have access to. Because the win condition is getting people off stage. So if you can be off stage and come back, very nice. And you know, while we said that, uh, Skunkle just kind of fell to their doom. <laughs> uh, so all that really cool gameplay. Uh, Mike now with a very strong stock lead. <laughs> also, Mike's internet has cleaned up. Zero packet drops. Uh, oh, wow. I, I think maybe the, the, the LAN fell out and he plugged it back in. Maybe. Uh, Skunkle, on the other hand. Uh oh. Xfinity showing their head. Already at around 40 drops. Kind of scared here. But I'm, I'm scared, which is why I'm here. Mike, on the other hand, doesn't afraid of anything and is ready to, you know, take on all the challenges thrown at him. He's at peace. We got an edge guard going. Ooh, this time Tech doesn't. Un that was incredible. This time not opting for the uh, the the bowling ball spam, but going off with that that runoff axe. I actually miss how the kill happened, uh, but that was actually just too sick to not talk about. How did he die? <laughs> I think I think there was I think there was a parry on the first hit of Bet. the smash attack and the second I think so. Could be completely wrong. Alright. Up throw up air. Ooh. Oh, Alright, we got a ground. And is that gonna be enough? Oh yeah, that's gonna be more than enough. So now we're gonna be going to a game three. Skunkle taking game two. Uh still using their lag powers. Uh, Mike was like, "This is enough. I will. Uh, I'll. I'll turn it off." But uh, Skunkle's like, "No, no. I want to. I want to see each individual frame. Every frame is a is a work of art. It is it is a painting. You know. He's just. I, 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 it makes sense that he's playing Inkling. You know, when when you want to see like the potential like Jackson Pollock that you can do with a forward smash. You know." Uh, Skunkle in the chat. Spectrum gives me depression, even on LAN. I, I understand, bro. I feel that. Okay, I see. I want to see that again because it did capture the, uh, the reverse axe, and that was kind of sick AF. Oh, you see that? Like, teched it too? Get out of here. But what a. S oh, wow. Actually, did you see that? Look at this. Sure. I feel like. Oh. Did, did he hit the wall twice? Because. 
boom, uh, red splatter. Oh. And then green splatter. I'm confused. Whoa, did he like hard SDI in or like DI in? I don't know. When you bounce off the stage, SDI back to the wall and then <laughs> tech it, and you're like, perfect. Maybe. Yeah, he hit the wall twice. I mean, that does uh, kind of make sense in the fact that like it is a sloped wall. So hit at the lower point, flies up, and then uh, is still in contact with it. So able to touch it again. So that would have been death on not PS2. The more you know. No All right, so let's see where we're going for game three. Are we just going to have an all PS2 set? Nothing wrong with that. Uh, sometimes you just want to keep a stage consistent no matter what that stage is. And you're like, you're the, it's like I will be the change I want to see. Be reading those self-help books. And it's like, real healthy, guys. I like to see it. Anyway, let's see. I, I don't think they left the arena, so I do think we're going back. We got real positive energy here. Oh, never mind. I'm completely wrong. Uh, I was too distracted by my dinner. Uh, we're going to... Uh, wow, so... Yeah, this is uh, Mike's counter picks. Being like, I'm going to take you to my home turf. All right? Because now I got my homies, my neighbors. We're going to roll up on you. Anyway... So, another pretty wide stage. But, um, not as big as PS2. This is kind of... I, this is actually the same size as FD, actually. It's just the camera, if I'm oh. remembering correctly. Um, but, yeah. So, ooh! Almost, man, when you try to bury your opponent, but they bury you instead, that's a pretty <laughs> rare matchup sort of thing. Huh? Okay. So... That was interesting. I, I kind of missed it. I'm going to just look at the tiny replay real quick. By the way, if you check caster resources, there's a link to see the last replay at all times. Oh, thank you. Oh, uh, okay. I think he did like Nair. Sorry, jumping from the ledge. Anyway, let's see. Is he able to get the kill with the up throw up air? No, no booyah, no booyah for us today. Uh, Mike, Mike's first stock lives to see another percent. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. This is really scary, bro. You got to get to center stage. You got to get to center stage. What are you doing? Get on those balloons and all right, nice. Uh, retreating to okay. All right, where are we going? We don't have an air dodge. We don't have any balloons. We only have one. The helium is gone. <laughs> all right. We just smacked him down with the down air. Oof. Okay, okay. Pretty even percent right now. Uh, Skunkle with a slight deficit. Uh, keeping the... Ooh! But it's hunting season. Got the axe out. Alright, Skunkle's gotta be a little bit careful. Uh... Town does have fairly close blast zones to the ledge. So, oh, 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 wait, what? He hit the balloons, but then he hit villager. That's what Inkling did. Okay, I feel like uh, I should have clipped it. Um, I feel like my, unless my eyes are deceiving me, I feel like the forward air hit both balloons, which isn't possible in this game because they have the same ID. Oh, that was interesting. I, I was okay. Yeah, maybe maybe I, I missed saw. Anyway, last stock. Um, really, uh, super low percent. Who's gonna poke up in this lead here? All right, get some ink. That's gonna do some extra damage. Ooh, roller. I like that Skunk was attempting to do a lot of those drag down upper combos. You saw that a couple times when Town City had the platforms, yeah. the tried platforms. Skunk would go for oh, that drag down upper. Ooh, but doesn't need to. Goes for the F smash. That Put is it. Put in the ground. They're an adult. Boom. 
All right. So Skunk will actually <coughs> moving on. Very nice. <clears throat> I'm going to DM you something. All right. If you don't mind. Go for it. Here. Thank you, Sweet Lou. I will check out my clip in a second. Hey, Munoz. Your, your. Munoz. Yeah, it's me. Let's go. The oh. other, uh, yeah. the other commentator. Yeah. Hey. 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 Yeah. Whoa. Okay. Let's get it. What's up? How you doing, bro? Yeah. Uh. What's good? Yeah. What's up? What's up, bro? I am choking on cauliflower How you guys doing? right now. Yeah. Eat that food, Devin. I'm trying. To. Cause I'm about to sip this drink. Nice. That's exactly what I sound like. Yeah, I mean, when I sip drink, the, the, you take little sippies, right? You know, that's, little that's, sippies, that's, yeah. that's just how it is. Yeah. Boom. Cool set. 